Hello and Gaming Night here again with a new episode of Mass Effect Andromeda. And since our last recording, they actually had an update. We are now not we are not 1.05 no more. We are 1.06. I do not know all that has entailed, but all I do know is is that we are going to the Nexus right away because of that arc right there. We are heading to the Nexus. See? That is a Solarian Arc. So we need to head to the Nexus. I'm guessing Meridian is right here. That is my guess. Look at all these planets we have to explore. I might do the planet scanning on my own, so you guys don't have to worry about seeing all that. So I know it can be quite boring. So but we must hit the Nexus first. For anything else, I'm hitting the Nexus first. Plain and simple. Because there are just important things. See, now you got all three. And you got three there. My question is, I mean, we still got this, uh, Um, dub, 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 the uh, Corian are coming in. So I'm wondering about that one. They're still building that stuff? I mean, come on, they should have most of that stuff done already. Back to the Nexus, and we'll. We got like three short side quests. Well, two short side quests, hopefully, and one major quest. Soon we would get in there. A hostage crisis in hydroponic. Haki, Kerry's producer. Got a sec? Mm. Haki, Kerry's producer. I'm the one making you look stunning for the documentary. There's a hitch. Kerry's been arrested for conspiracy to incite unrest. Oh boy. She's in a cell at the militia headquarters. Any chance you could stop by? A visit from you might shake things up. Remember, okay. Kerry's down in the militia cells. She'd probably love a visit. I yeah, I can do that. Hmm. All right. Well, hold on. Yeah, they're all. They are all that way. Okay. Hey. Do I actually sense them right here real quick? I am going to get rid of my junk. Sell salvage. Confirm trade. All right. Oh, I better start going through that stuff. You know, like stuff will produce better. Uh, he's probably still sleeping, so. To there we go. Hakim said they arrested you over the documentary. Guess I tweaked the lion's tail too hard. You had to tell the truth, whatever the cost. You did what was right. You know, they've had other people in the cells. Rioters, people crying and scared. Hmm. Me and my truth did that to them. So you're just going to sit there? This is how your work ends? What? No. 
Hell no. Maybe I could use this. Thanks for coming, Ryder. I I'll send word if anything changes. Let me join that little one. Before I do that, do I have anyone I can, uh, uh, what is it, uh, do 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 Pathfinder. Ah. Any word from Dr. Kennedy? Now she's on Prodromos? She's as difficult as she always was, which is how it should be. Andromeda isn't supposed to change everything. You two seem very different. Mm -hmm. I met Jean at a university bar. She was talking libertarian and drinking vodka slimes. No. I instantly hated her. An hour later, we were back to back fighting half a lacrosse team. And somehow, she hadn't started it. I bet there's someone like that on your ship. They drive you crazy, but for some reason, you just click. Uh... Oh. <laughs> yeah. Some people just... Yeah. Yeah. Then you understand. Life is so safe without those kinds of people. Some might say better, but they're not in the initiative. Director Addison, Pathfinder. Shepard, Rex. Shepard, Rex. I'm sorry. I enjoyed that part of a uh, mass. The first Mass Effect. Hello again. They're waiting for you. Careful. Ryder made a sentimental choice saving those Krogan. She looked at them and thought of you. Ryder's her own person. Just admit you don't like Krogan. <clears throat> the Pathfinder. Ryder, we were just discussing your encounter with the Archon. Mm. There was no time to save both. I had to make a decision. Such is the burden of leadership. Nevertheless, it is good to see Ark Parchero reunited with the Nexus. Yet I have to question what we gained, provoking the Archon like this. He had a map showing the location of Meridian. Now we have it, and a short window to get there. It's the control center for the terraforming network. If we get that working, all our problems are solved. Based on what data? This is all alien science. The vault on Aya suggests that Meridian is the key. While I appreciate what you've done for our strike teams, we're not equipped for a war with the Cat. They'll be defending Meridian with everything they've got. Hmm. If we do nothing, I guarantee there's a fight coming. The Archon's already studying how to exalt us. It's not pretty. Still, it's better to focus on the outposts. If the Cat attack, at least our people won't be in one place. Then there's this Sam of yours. We took a chance letting AI get involved. Uh, Frankly, I'm uncomfortable with just how involved it's become. I can't support your plan, Ryder. Then I will. And so will I. I agree. Ryder deserves a chance to try. I applaud the gesture, but you answer to me. I hope you understand. Hmm. What's the matter, Tan? Don't want anyone else overshadowing you? It's not called the Pathfinder Initiative. The chain of command has to be respected. That is all. Why am I surprised? I don't exactly have a plan B. There may be a way. Pathfinder, apologies. There was an urgent message for you. They said your brother is awake. Oh. What? Go. We'll talk later. In the tech lab. D yeah, uh, the... Okay, finally. Scott. There you are. Touchy feely time. Don't you think you slept in long enough? I thought it was Saturday, then Sunday. Then I figured someone turned the alarm off. No. Oh. Well, I sure missed having you around. We've hit a few rough patches along the way. I'm sorry I wasn't there when Dad died. No one could have saved him, Scott. I wasn't even sure I should tell you. I'm glad you did. That would have been a hell of a thing to wake up to. I'll miss him. 
But right about now, he'd be telling us to stop moaning and get on with it. There's no shortage of things to do. <laughs> yeah, I hear you're the great and honorable Madam Pathfinder. <laughs> Please, it's nothing like that. As soon as I get my gear, well... Be careful. No way are you fit for duty, sir. You need a chance to mend. Yeah, says who? The Pathfinder, that's who. Time to rest up. That's an order, Specialist Rider. <laughs> <laughs> Pulling rank already. <laughs> Fat boy, tell about that year you only ate paste. Was it first grade or second? You can keep talking if you'd like. Just no arm wrestling. <laughs> Ryder, this is Pathfinder Ricks. We have some ideas about Meridian. Come by the tech lab as soon as possible. Will do. Hey. You feeling out of the loop, I imagine? A little. Though I've heard bits and pieces of things from Harry and the med techs. Sounds pretty serious. Mm. Just the fate of the entire initiative. Every man, woman, child, and everything in between facing certain extinction. The, the usual. usual. Oh. Well, I'm sure the Pathfinder manual covers that. <laughs> yeah, we'll have it wrapped by lunch. There's a race of aliens called the Cat. They're led by a scary nutjob named Archon who wants to turn all of us into them. We both want Meridian, which is the heart of an alien terraforming network we're trying to activate. We do that, maybe we live. Look at my big sister being all proactive. Meanwhile, I'm mastering the art of peeing in a plastic jar. <laughs> You should also know, Dad was keeping some secrets from us. Like what? Turns out Sam is even smarter than anyone knew. And Dad juiced his connection to Sam. It's a lot more powerful than other Pathfinders. So is mine. I guess rank has its privileges. What was Dad up to? Dad encrypted some of his memories in Sam. I've started unlocking them. What were they? You hmm. and I were there. So was Mom. You actually saw her? It was at the hospital the day she died. And that reunion dinner she wanted us at so badly. Right. Dad was his usual talkative self. But there was something else. I saw Dad talk with a benefactor in the Milky Way. Some initiative bigwig I'd never heard of. That's news to me. Yeah. I'm still hoping I can figure out what it all means. Hmm. Feeling homesick at all? Still trying to get my sea legs, but... I think about what might have been if everything hadn't gotten screwed up. Ooh. What do you think would be different? Well, while you were looking for Prothean artifacts, I was standing watch over a Mass Effect relay. Hell of a thing to stare at every day. I'd dream about what was on the other side. The adventures I would have. Mm. The things I would accomplish. But when everything got screwed up, well, I guess I'll never know. Screwed up how? start with mom dying I never cried so hard and dad he was never the same after that mm. he put so much into Sam to save her but well AI is as illegal as it gets in the Milky Way after the Alliance kicked him out for it everything changed suddenly being Alec Ryder's kid was a black mark you and I were never going to live that down mm. I thought maybe we could talk about mom and dad. Sure. What about them? Mm. You still think about mom? Sorry, I'm just kind of interested. Yeah. Especially now. I wonder what she'd say if she could see us. Dad talked about her before we went on our first mission. Really? After she died, dad seemed to shut down. He hadn't talked about her in years. He loved her. I think he was just lost. We all were. What do you remember about how they met? Well, she was in the Alliance, researching early biotic implants. Mm. That's about the time she met Dad. He was on Earth for N7 training, I think. He says he swooped in and swept her off her feet. Had a whole bad boy in uniform vibe that was irresistible. Dad? I guess it worked. They got married. Then the first contact war started, and he was sent off to fight. After that, we were born. My dad was posted to the Citadel as an attaché. An attaché. What do you remember about Mom's biotic research? 
Hmm. Mostly, that it's the thing that finally killed her. Biotics weren't unknown back then. So were the dangers. All sorts of rare diseases hit people working around Izo. Mom was trying to design implants to help people harness their abilities. She was a pioneer. And she actually gave it to him. What do you remember about growing up on the Citadel? Big hmm. space station chock full of all sorts of aliens. Scary at first, but... Pretty soon, I was playing laser tag with Turian and Salarian kids. <laughs> Looking back on it, maybe that's why I'm here. The Citadel showed me life has no limit on possibilities. It made me ask, what else is out there? A lot. Thought you might want to know how Dad died. I was going to ask you. Habitat 7. There was this alien terraforming machine that had us stranded. Dad figured it out and shut it down. That saved us our ass. Then, all hell broke loose. My helmet got smashed. I couldn't breathe. I was suffocating. Then, Dad gave me his helmet. He sacrificed himself? Only one of us could make it, and he didn't hesitate. He was a hero. All those stories about him being an N7, kicking ass in the military. Mm. I always thought they were exaggerating. You should have seen him in action. Taking out Ket left and right it was amazing. Huh. Dad, the badass one-man army. Pretty good way to remember him. Oh, yeah. All right. Well, I'll let you take it easy then. Yeah, you wouldn't believe how slammed I am. Got a nap, then doze a bit, then try to catch up on sleep. <laughs> You'll get better. Now, before you find that meridian, I want in. I'll take pictures. <laughs> All right. This is not good. All right. To the Duck and Bay. Yeah, of course. Really, you gotta do this stupid thing. Ryder, good to see you. We've been working with Dr. Aradana and her team on the problem of getting to Meridian. We think we have the answer. I'm listening. It's plans for new technology we've designated Ghost Storm. Mm -hmm. As you approach Meridian, our own ships can broadcast fake returns for the Tempest. The Ket won't know which is real. It will confuse their sensors and draw their ships off. It could buy you some time. I can work with that. Just enough to give us an advantage. The rest is up to you. I can handle it. What means going against the initiative? We're alone here. You didn't hear that. Hear what? We've been collating gamma charts all day. Hmm. A risk comes with the job. Part of being a pathfinder. Sure, if they'd pay us once in a while. <laughs> Not after this. First, you'll need to research the Ghost Storm technology. Then we'll rendezvous at Meridian. Mm. Good luck. Largely because Ket technology appears mimetic, taking designs from different sources to improve their own. Mm. It is a familiar pattern. Observe, conquer, incorporate. How much of Andromeda's life has been suffocated or lost? I cannot speculate, Professor. We should anticipate the cat learning from and incorporating initiative technology as well.
Hmm. I guess we're going to the Tempest. Alright. Moving on. Do we can jump over here? Oh. Yeah, I can. <laughs> And we see the Tempest taken off. Loading screen! Drink break. Ah! Oop. Getting stuck. I'm really enjoying this game. I mean, I'm like 45 hours into it, and if you guys have been watching the series this long, kudos to you guys. Because I'm enjoying this game. She is down in Yeah, she'll talk to Luxury real quick before I do that. on the deck. You found them too? I think something's eating our stores. Hmm. We need to talk about Sam. Dr. Taparo does not approve of how we escaped the Ket containment field on the Archon's flagship. Mm -hmm. By stopping the Pathfinder's heart? No, I do not approve. Hey, it worked. Relax, Doc. It turned out okay. Dying, even temporarily, is never okay. Ryder, Sam killed you. Yes, he brought you back, but what if he didn't? I cannot learn without the Pathfinder. That would be akin to killing a part of myself. Your lines of code, you can't die. Sam would never hurt me. Thank you, Ryder. <sighs> Look, I'm not against Sam. I'm not against you, Sam. But my job's hard enough without an AI stopping your heart. Even to save your life. Mm. All right, I'll find a new party trick. Have Gil teach you three card Monty or something. Lexi, I apologize for any distress I have caused you. <sighs> and I'm sorry for calling you lines of code. You're more than that. <laughs> even if you don't have cells to prove it. Can we just save a body? That'd be awesome. So, if I have it guessed correctly, that's why I've been getting these weird. See? Cereal crumbs, lots of them. Cereal crumbs, lots of them. Something's nesting here. Something that likes cereal. I wonder. We've probably got materials to build a humane trap and catch it. Huh. Upstairs. It's what keeps vibrating. I couldn't figure it out. Now I have. 
Don't worry, I will integrate that stuff in a second. Promise, promise. One trap ready for a visitor. I'll leave it and see what we get. Hey, Joel. The Coast Storm technology has been fully researched, Pathfinder. Excellent. We're ready to make our push on Meridian then. I'll call a meeting immediately. Prepping VidCon communications. The Nexus leaders think our search for Meridian is a waste of time, but we know they're wrong. Turning on vaults won't be enough without the heart of the system. Hmm. Just to clarify, you're defying a direct order? Hell yeah, I am. It's my job to bring us home, and that's what I'm doing, with or without permission. Aha, that's the spirit. Aha. <laughs> and the kit? That's where the ghost storm technology comes in. Isn't that right, Hater? Exactly. Our forge signals should divert some tech from you. It won't be all of them, but it'll be enough. The Tempest is small and fast. I don't need a big window. We'll drop you off and make our exit before the Ket catch on. Once we're on Meridian, it'll be a small team. Move fast, figure out its secrets. Right behind enemy lines. Good time to assess their numbers, defenses. Hmm. And when you're ready, we'll extract you the same way we got you in. If we come back with actuals on Meridian, the Nexus will sit up. Sounds like a solid plan, team. Hager, you ready? Good to go on your word, Pathfinder. All right, guys, this is it. Let's get moving. Hmm. All right. So we are going to go there. Um. Anyone seen a hex jet battery? The one nope. Of course not. No. Right. Couldn't digest it without heavy processing. Cellulolysis would be hugely inefficient. Hmm. Are you still trying to figure out how to eat Helius flora? Oh shoot! I was talking out loud again, wasn't I? <laughs> Where are we going? Hello. Yes, we're continuing the story, main story, and I don't care. Because as far as I'm aware, we can go back after the main story is finish out those side quests. If the Archon's information is right, this is the system. Meridian should be here somewhere. I'm right, gonna tell where it's at. Ta-da! But. We are going to scan the system first real quick. I'm picking up something. Probe away. Take it. Cool. I find something. Ah, I sheet. Dude, that's like a nice lush planet to live on. Water, land. Probe 
launched. Tracking a huge mineral deposit. Alright, we'll go to this one. Fifty percent, huh? Which means there's more of this one than you see I. Get by the scourge That's too. It. That's Meridian. Or Kitasira, as the Kev called it. it. Looks like a giant space station. It is. But I get hit by the scourge as well. Check that out. Alright, we're starting this goes. We are starting this, folks. I got my snipey, that one. Maybe I'm a supposed to be pistols. Hmm. Lots of damage. Less ammo. One sixteen. Maybe yeah, a lot less ammo. Sixteen. Alright. We're going with this. And there's a cat ship. Initiating ghost storm on my mark. Three, two, go. Enemy signature detected. Commence pursuit. Hager, it's working. Reading a bunch of cat headed our way, pulling back. It's all on you now, Tempest. We should get them as close as possible to here. Intense readings could be some kind of control center. No decent landing sites. This could get messy. How messy? Ryder, looks like a flyby is our only option. I'll get as low as possible, but you'll have to eject over the target area. This is our one shot. We have to take the risk. You've fallen out of things before, right? Just don't scream too loud on the way down. It's embarrassing. <laughs> All right, you know the drill. Watch your rate of descent. Shield should take care of the rest. So far, so good. The cat haven't detected us. But once we go in, we'll be clear as day to any troops on the ground. The Tempest can take some shots if it has to. Some. Not many. I jumped. Nearby. Your scanner should be picking them up. It's raining? How is it raining? Pathfinder, while interacting with that console, I detected the presence of a complex network connected via a central command hub. A hub? You mean we found Meridian's controls? Most likely. However, the hub is dark, deactivated. Do 
Meridian's all about. We can start by finding its central hub. Pathfinder, we are looking at the central command hub I detected earlier. As with the monoliths and vaults, the hub is connected to the two neighboring towers. Hmm. So activating the towers will also activate the command hub. Change in plan. I say we activate Meridian now. Forgetting about the ket? Activating a vault has previously activated a purification field. Perhaps Meridian is similar. Let's mm -hmm. head to those towers and see what we can find. Pathfinder, interfacing with that console has activated a gravity well. Maybe I can learn some more about the remnant from here. Wow. I feel really small right now. Pathfinder, I'm picking up radio interference. A cat signal. Wonderful. The detect signal was a decoy. Key to zero has been infiltrated. All units are to focus on incapacitation and capture of the Pathfinder. Want Ryder? Gotta go through us, asshole. Hmm. I wonder if there's a broken Atmo processor somewhere that's causing this downpour. Let's not get distracted trying to fix the weather, okay? Not go in that water, shall we? Get that water in dangerous. Your step. The rain makes everything a little slick. Right now, I've got the remnant too. Really? So, Pathfinder, left or right? Uh, enemy first. Detecting high levels of scourge energy. Be careful.
Looks like the remnant took out some cat garbage. It still hurts to see it. Sometimes. Gotta hope so. We will. I've got a feeling about this. I've never seen anything like this. Pathfinder, it appears the energy waves from these creatures contributed to the scourge throughout Helios. So whatever happened here caused the scourge to erupt all across the cluster. Yes, Pathfinder. The scourge started here. With the remnant builders. This is an impact crater. It could have been an attack. I don't know, but this looks like a shooting gallery to me. Detecting low levels of power, Pathfinder. A scan may help identify conduits. to parts of the system are preventing power up. Mm. Can we reroute past the damage? That may work, Pathfinder. Boosting trace signals. Some kind of glyph on this thing. It matches the pattern on the main console, Pathfinder. Okay. Let's 
see about rerouting the power past all the damage. Excellent. So far, so good. Oh, yeah. So I think line go across the thing, so. So far, so good. Do, 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 do. That's it. The primary console should work now, Pathfinder. All right. Provisional repairs are complete, Pathfinder. Only one way to know for sure. Translating. Flight control systems online. Welcome, administrator. I have a bad feeling. I don't like this. We should get out of here. Restoring the systems appears to have reactivated something else nearby. I can see that, Sam, and I don't think it's good. Oh, oh. vessels on standby. We have seen remnant ships, but none in working condition. It says it cannot retrieve commands from the Meridian engine. Huh. Meridian engine. Sam, do you know what... They're going to be trouble. Oh, shit. right here. Nope, not moving. And my dogs are going crazy. No, 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 no. fight. Okay, 
strategy. get that second one shot but I have a feeling I'm running did anyone actually live here or was this just all right the Archon's forces have been here for years they're nowhere close to being able to understand Revan tech and that was me those things so much. Turret. Thank you. Mine.
You take care of that. I'll do this. I think that's the last of them. For now. There's a shooting gallery again. Oh, come on. This screams like you're in for a fight. I have seen organisms like these on Havaru. It's very dark in here. Yes, it is. Stasis pods? What the hell? Translating. Pattern 1-3. Viability 56.2%. Genetic template transmitted for testing. They were doing things to the Ankara. We can't be sure what this is yet, Joel. Really? Because the last time we saw something like this, the Kent were turning us into them. Sam, I need an analysis. It appears that these beings are not Angara. They are not even alive. I don't understand. They look so... The remnant language refers to these bodies as genetic templates. Hmm. A blueprint. Like the plants we saw. The Angara? We came from here? They created us? Why? Maybe they intended the Angara for some purpose that was never fulfilled. And what does that mean for the Angara? Oh boy. Me. This is big. Too big. The Moshai. We have to tell her about this. She'll know what to do. Meridian creates life. And the Archon could use it to do the opposite. Destroy everything. It's up to us to make sure that doesn't happen. We crack Meridian's controls first. We make sure the Archon can't use it. Jal, everything okay? That stuff back there can't be easy to process. I'll be all right. It helps to know I have the support to friends like you. We're all in this together. Observers weren't here before, were they? You activated the remnant systems here, Pathfinder. They are likely resuming their duties. Should have command to have access now. Unless Sam's wrong, of course. All right, two towers going. Should get us into Meridian's main control room. They're like, they're in there like playing God or something. Dang it. Ah, oh, shit. Turn on my side so much. That's awesome.
Yep. Area cleared. Raining in a huge spaceship. Hmm. Uh, the kept were making themselves comfy here. Oh shit. now another come on Two, huh? Make that three. All right, fighting this way.
Damn. Maybe I can get through here. All right. How many secrets does this place hold? No idea. That looks like the gravity well. Yes, it does. Let's load up. But I'm in this gravity well. And you are going to hate me at this point because it has time to come to end this episode, unfortunately. And we're going to end it right here. Yes, I'm ending it right here. So, go ahead and hit that like button if you like this video. If not, go ahead and dislike, but please go ahead and subscribe. And also check out my links down below. Go ahead and comment as well. I'd like to hear about all your likes, dislikes, uh, hints, tips, tricks, whatever. So, please go ahead. And until next time... <laughs> Cliffhanger.